In mathematics, an ultrametric space is a metric space in which the triangle inequality is strengthened to d x z max d x y d y z Display style D X Z L E Q max left D X Y D Y Z right. Sometimes the associated metric is also called a non-Archimedean metric or supermetric. Although some of the theorems for ultrametric spaces may seem strange at a first glance, they appear naturally in many applications. Topic: Formal definition. Formally, an ultrametric space is a set of points m, display style m, with an associated distance function, also called a metric d m times m r. Display style d colon m times m right arrow math bound r, where r display style math bound r is the set of real numbers such that for all x, y, z element of m. Display style x, y, z in M. One has d x y zero. Display style d x y g e q zero d x y equals zero. Display style d x y equals zero. I f f x equals y. Display style x equals y. D x y equals d y x. Display style d x y equals d y x symmetry d x z max d x y d y z Display style D, X, Z, L E Q, Max, left, D, X, Y, D, Y, Z, right. Strong triangle or ultrametric inequality. In the case when M Display style M is a group written additively and D Display style D is generated by a length function display style cdot so that d x y equals x minus y display style d x y equals x y the last property can be made stronger using the Kroll sharpening to x plus y max x y display style x plus y leq max left x y right with equality if x does not equal Y display style x n e q y. We want to prove that if x plus 
y max x y display style x plus y leq max left x y right then the equality occurs if x does not equal y display style x neq y without loss of generality let us assume that x greater than y display style x greater than y this implies that x plus y x display style x plus y leq x but we can also compute x equals x plus y minus y max x plus y y Display style x equals x plus y y leq max left x plus y y right. Now the value of max x plus y y display style max left x plus y y right cannot be y display style y for if that is the case we have x y display style x leq y contrary to the initial assumption thus max x plus y y equals x plus y display style max left x plus y y right equals x plus y and x x plus y display style x leq x plus y Using the initial inequality, we have x x plus y x display style x leq x plus y leq x, and therefore x plus y equals x display style x plus y equals x topic properties from the above definition one can conclude several typical properties of ultrametrics for example in an ultrametric space for all x y z element of m display style x y z in m and r s element of r display style r s in math bound r at least one of the three equalities D x y equals D y z display style D x y equals D y z or D x z equals D y Z 
display style d x z equals d y z or d x y equals d z x display style d x y equals d z x holds that is every triple of points in the space forms an isosceles triangle so the whole space is an isosceles set in the following the concept and notation of an open ball is the same as in the article about metric spaces ie B x r equals y element of M d x y r display style B x r equals y in M d x y. Every point inside a ball is its center, i.e., if d x y r display style d x y, then B x r equals B y r display style B x r equals B y r. Intersecting balls are contained in each other, i.e., if B x R B Y S display style B x R cap B Y S is non-empty, then either B x R B Y S display style B x R subset B Y S or B Y S B x R display style B Y S subset B x R. All balls of strictly positive radius are both open and closed sets in the induced topology. That is, open balls are also closed, and closed balls replace display style with display style leq are also open. The set of all open balls with radius r and center in a closed ball of radius r greater than zero, display style r greater than zero, forms a partition of the latter, and the mutual distance of two distinct open balls is again equal to r, display style r. Proving these statements is an instructive exercise. All directly derive from the ultrametric triangle inequality. Note that, by the second statement, a ball may have several center points that have non-zero distance. The intuition behind such seemingly strange effects is that, due to the strong triangle inequality, distances in ultrametrics do not add up. Topic examples The discrete metric is an ultrametric. The p-adic numbers form a complete ultrametric space. Consider the set of words of arbitrary length, finite or infinite, sigma asterisk over some alphabet sigma. Define the distance between two different words to be two minus n, where n is the first place at which the words differ. The resulting metric is an ultrametric. The set of words with glued ends of the length n over some alphabet sigma is an ultrametric space with respect to the p-close distance. Two words x and y are p-close if any substring of p, p if r equals r n is a sequence of real numbers decreasing to zero, then x r equals lim s u p n infinity x n r n induces an ultrametric on the space of all complex sequences for which it is finite. Note that this is not a seminorm since it lacks homogeneity. If the Rn are allowed to be zero, one should use here the rather unusual convention that OO equals zero. If G is an edge weighted undirected graph, all edge weights are positive, and D U, v is the weight of the minimax path between U and V, that is, the largest weight of an edge. On a path chosen to minimize this largest weight, then the vertices of the graph, with distance measured by D, form an ultra metric space, and all finite ultrametric spaces may be represented in this way. Applications 
A contraction mapping may then be thought of as a way of approximating the final result of a computation which can be guaranteed to exist by the Banach fixed point theorem. Similar ideas can be found in domain theory. P adic analysis makes heavy use of the ultrametric nature of the P adic metric. In solid state physics, applications are also known, namely in the treatment of spin glasses by the replica theory of Giorgio Parisi and co workers, and also in the theory of aperiodic solids. In taxonomy and phylogenetic tree construction, ultrametric distances are also utilized by the UPGMA and WPGMA methods. These algorithms require a constant rate assumption and produce trees in which the distances from the root to every branch tip are equal. When DNA, RNA and protein data are analyzed, the ultrametricity assumption is called the molecular clock. Models of intermittency in three-dimensional turbulence of fluids make use of so-called cascades, and in discrete models of dyadic cascades, which have an ultrametric structure. In geography and landscape ecology, ultrametric distances have been applied to measure landscape complexity and to assess the extent to which one landscape function is more important than another. <laughs> 